Girl, stop. Carry on. Hey Design Squad, welcome back to my channel. As you can tell by the title, we are doing a Ivy Park haul. Period. Literally, since Beyonce came out with Ivy Park, I've been waiting. Okay, literally waiting to get my hands on some of the items. You know what I mean? Not just to do the haul, but just to have. I just think it's nice for a black woman to have a collection with a very big, well-known, leading sports athletic brand. Okay? It's everything. So she came out with Drip 2 on October 30th. I'm not exactly sure of the dates, just to be honest with you, but she came out with Drip 2 on October 30th. And um, I was able to get about three or four pieces. So I'll insert pictures. I'm not going to like put that in this haul. Um, this is just strictly for the 2.2 drip or whatever. Your girl did get a lot of items here. So I was like, let me go ahead and do a haul for the girls. Okay, we're gonna go ahead and get into the video. If you are new here, hey girl, I do videos on beauty, fashion, and lifestyle. So if you like my style, my personality, my vibe or whatever, sis, don't be shy. Make sure you click that subscribe button down below as well as the notification bell. And you're notified each and every time I upload a video. Also, don't forget to follow me at iDesign8 on Instagram so you can catch some of my fashion posts as well as life updates over there so sis i'm not gonna hold y'all okay i know y'all want to see it i know y'all ready so let's go ahead and get straight into the video all right sis so i feel like i got some really cute items i'm not exactly sure how much i spent i think it was probably about eight eight or nine hundred dollars for this drip and then i think for the first drip um that came out on october 30th i think it was about four hundred or five hundred dollars but i did want to be intentional um with my purchase because when you're dropping that amount of money on a specific item um you want to make sure it's something that you're going to wear you know i knew i wanted to do a haul for you guys but i didn't want to just pick up items just to have for the haul because i'm like uh -uh, like some of them things i would never wear and then some of the items i just couldn't get my hands on so i probably would have spent more money some of the items like the gender neutral items were available so Beyonce said she ain't come to play with you girls today, okay? Like she said she's coming with the heat all 2020, okay? Hey, I gave y'all the first drip, we doing drip two, but hey, hold up, wait. We got a drip 2.2, period. So yes, when I see the black collection, like I love the first collection, like the colors in the first collection, but the black, you know, black just do it for you, okay? All right, so here's the first item that I'm going to show. So here is the knitted crop top in black. It was $76 and I got a size medium. I actually got this top last time in the color brown and that was $75. I don't know why there's a dollar difference there, um, but I got it in small. But honestly, I don't, the only reason why I got that crop top in small was because that was the only size that was available and I was like, like, y'all not about to take this from me, sis. So I got it. Luckily, I could fit it, but it was just super, 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 super tight. But this one fits better. Now, I'm not going to lie, sis. These Ivy Park items are a struggle, okay? A struggle to get in. <laughs> Even though I went up a size and it does fit better, it still was a struggle to get on. But it is literally such a gorgeous crop top. And I just love the color in it. It really, like, girl, I am so not blessed in this area and it's literally doing something for me in this area like i don't have to wear a bra it's just giving the girls what they need so i just love the length of the sleeves i love how it just ooh snatches you in sis like beyonce did that with this it does have the wire right here it just gives you that really snatched in illusion kind of like a corset you know type of feel but it just really conforms to the body sis so as far as it being 76 dollars i really do believe that it's worth it this is something that you can wear you know casually or you can wear dressed up it is a great quality just the look and the feel of it it just really snatches you in it gives you the perfect amount of coverage um it's not doing too much and it's very subtle like i like it i really like it i paired it with these leggings baby is she giving body okay let me know let me know if she giving body yaddy yaddy so I got the knitted leggings in black. These leggings were $100. So again, difficult to get them on. But once you finally get them on, and I got these in a size medium, but once you finally get them on, like, baby, like, they're, they're, they're giving really snatch, okay? One of the things that I really like about these leggings is that it has this very, very 
thick waistband right here so if i wanted to wear it to work out in i could or if i just wanted to wear it like you know as just a fashion piece i definitely could by adding like some heels or like some boots to it and i also love the fact that with the leggings the design on the side is very subtle so it's not like something you can see like such as this this is not bad don't get me wrong but because these leggings are very simple and it doesn't have this design in it you can definitely get a lot of use out of it by pairing it with a lot of different colors tops jackets whatever sis this is how it looks in the back i don't know if you can see it but it says ivy park here on the back again very very subtle a hundred dollars sis do i think it's worth it for a hundred dollars okay um i know that there's other leggings that really snatches you in and you're not paying a hundred dollars for a pair of leggings i'm not going to say that they're worth it um i could have definitely got some other leggings that you know give me the same look and feel for half the price um but i won't lie it does give you a very nice snatched look like is it just me or <laughs> i'm paying that type of money for some leggings sis? i want ivy park to be all over like I want y'all to see I got Ivy Park, okay? This is Ivy Park. It says Ivy Park, okay? <laughs> That's just my mindset, but when I take a step back, I'm like, hmm, I like that it doesn't have the Ivy Park all over because, like I said, I can get a lot of uses out of these. All right, sis, so, so here's the next item, and I'm not going to hold you. Like, this is probably my favorite favorite out of everything that I got um, because I literally feel like I'm getting my money's worth okay so this is the Ivy Park convertible jacket it is gender neutral um, and I got a size small and I paid $200 for it I like the fact that I'm literally getting so many different options when it comes to this jacket it has a hood so I'm just showing you how it comes like you know without me styling it does have like this little mask right here like super cute like you probably can't hear me but it does have a little mask right here and a little zipper right here i could have went down to an extra small um i actually like the oversized like baggy feel um and i think that it fits me perfectly like the arms are just a little bit big like i won't lie about that um but i do think that it fits me perfectly until we come to like the hood and the mask like the mask it like falls down a little bit so I could have went down to an extra small in this jacket and I still feel like it would have gave me that oversized feel but a little bit more fitting as you can see this jacket is completely customizable so you can literally make it into any style that you want it to be in so I'm just going to show you a few different styles so it has like a little zipper right here so if you wanted to you can wear it like this this is dope okay this is so fire like I really like this also, it does have um, a zipper right here if you want more of a crop look. Sis, baby, how dope is this? I love the details, like every little detail, regardless if you wear long line, thigh length, or like crop, every little detail is just hitting even with it being cropped i really like how the pockets kind of hang just a little bit longer um so you can really see that detail there so it does have like velcro where you can adjust your arms so you got this look right here like i said it is a little bit too big for me these arms right here has these little snaps so you can definitely snap the arm out and then bam you can wear it sleeveless obviously if i didn't have this crop top on you'll see a little bit more skin this is so dope to me. So as far as the jacket being $200, sis, is it worth it? I would say for the quality, the name, as well as how much you can customize this jacket, I would say that it is worth $200 because you have a lot of styles that you can create with this jacket. All right, girls. Whew, this legit was a workout. <laughs> legit this was not easy to get into so the next thing i got was the knitted cat suit in black now this was 140 dollars and this is the size medium when i first was looking at the other cat suit um i'm so glad that i didn't get that one because like it was honestly just not my color the black one to me like i said it's just a little bit more universal so you can wear it with a lot of different items and you know it's very much like simplistic so anyway here's the cat suit super cute again like i said beyonce said she's not playing with 
two girls she is snatching bodies okay literally I mean it does remind me of the leggings like I said it was very hard to get in so sis I would definitely not go down a size you can see on my thumbnail or I'm just going to insert a picture here you can see how I styled it um, I will say that it does have like a little bit of like extra room right here which I wanted it to kind of you know you know suck your girl in but it's fine okay it's fine at first when I tried it on I actually had the straps just regular like how these straps are and I was just like like it's not it's it's not doing it for me like in my opinion like in my opinion I was like I'm about to take a picture in this like I really want people to see that this is Ivy Park but this is not doing it for me like the, the jumpsuit is so plain and so I decided to crisscross these like straps right here these straps are legit very very stretchy as you can see but they're also adjustable so you can adjust them in the back just to give me a little bit of style a little bit of flavor girl okay you know making the girls mad or whatever but this is cute I really like it and like I said you can definitely do a lot of different styles with this jumpsuit here I'm not mad at all I feel like I'm the first one that did this I don't know though okay don't quote me but I just feel like I am okay so if you see anybody else do what they did it because of me period is it worth it to me sis I don't think so um it kind of reminds me like I stated of the leggings I can definitely find a jumpsuit that is very similar to this you know that really snatches me in um just give me that stylish look as well um for half the price um i do love it don't get me wrong i was more excited about it when before i got it than when i actually got it i was like oh, okay like it was a little bit more like underwhelming but i definitely felt like it could have snatched me in just a little bit more here in her waist area would i buy this again no unless she coming out with a very fire i mean fire color and while i have this one i'm just going to throw on this suit that I got. I got the suit wide lit pants in black. Um, I actually got these in a small because I did purchase these last time in the, I think it's green, blue color. I can't remember the color. And I got that in a medium and they were just a little bit too big for me. Um, so I got these in a small and they were $100. And then I got the Ivy Park blazer in black. Um, I actually got this in a medium. I had this in a medium last time because you guys know I like my blazers oversized and this was $160. One thing I will say about the um, Ivy Park is I love the fact that legit everything that she has in her collection can all be interchangeable. So you can wear this with that, that with that, you know what I mean? And you can have a whole look. It's a lot of black suits, so you may not be able to see it. One of the things that I love about this suit and I will try and get it in each and every color, no matter what she comes out with, is that it is so stylish like I like that it's very comfortable but it's also very much stylish I honestly feel like this is something that you could possibly wear to work for a business casual setting um just depending on how you dress it underneath like obviously I wouldn't wear this underneath but if you was to throw on a nice little blouse this is something that you probably could wear it's the three stripes going down the side of the blazer as well as the pants on one side and then it is very much plain here on this side now it still says Ivy Park you really can't tell like I said the words on this side which is the left side is very subtle like this is boss status don't talk to me status I'm a bad status like you know what I mean like this is it is it worth it I completely think that it's worth it especially the blazer I really will tell you if you don't get anything else I really will tell you that the blazer is definitely definitely worth it because you can really style it a lot of different ways I feel the same way about the bottoms but not as much as I do about the blazer so the bottoms you can kind of get away with but like I say to this set right here the suit is so fire that I would say it's worth it for the whole 260 sis okay all right you guys so here is the last item that I got from Ivy Park this is a three stripe jumpsuit um, I actually got this in an extra small because it's a gender neutral item and also I paid $150 for it I just wanted to show you just like how it looked before I actually like style it I could have did an extra extra small okay regardless like it is a very loose jumpsuit it's not something that's supposed to be like too hugging or anything like that on you which is completely fine i really like that it has the three stripes right here it's super cute and again it's subtle it's not too much you know what i mean like i feel like these colors just go perfectly together it does button the whole way down so it gets to your crotch area and it also has like these little drawstrings right here which i really like because sis okay it does wonders look at me i'm looking so snatched right now 
Like, I really like this look. It does have the same adjustable Velcro strap as the jacket. It's still a little bit big for me, but it's not too serious. I kind of like this oversized feel anyway. I just went ahead and added these, like, black boots to them, these black sock boots to them. And I just love this oversized, very casual, but still, you know, stylish look. We here for it. This is how the back looks, and then the butt says Ivy Park. As far as it being worth $150, I will say that it's worth $150 um, only because I really like this item and like I said it's not as versatile as the other items but I still really like it and like I said I love the style, I love the fit of it. Okay Beyonce, next time Beyonce you have a drop if you see my video, period, please put me on the PR list like girl, I'm here, I've been a fan for a very long time, a very long time, please put me on the PR list okay. You can um, email me. <laughs> I loved everything that I got. Um, there was nothing that I really just could not see myself in or just couldn't rock and just wear various ways. I'm here for it. I love it. Like I said, I'm just a big supporter in general because I really like that black women is doing a damn thing okay all right design squad so that completes this ivy part try on haul i hope that you guys enjoyed it leave me comments down below letting me know what was your favorite item or look from this haul was it a yay for you was it a nay for you like leave all that down below i love interacting with you guys i appreciate you so much for watching i do hope you have a great day and i will see you in my next video